welcome back to my channel. I am Casual Geeky Gaming, and you can call me Casual. And this is my trip to become human, episode number 14. Now, last time we broke into Pirate's Cove. I hope you're okay today. I know sometimes things can be difficult, but I'm here for you. Thank you. I broke into Pirate Cove and stayed there for the night, and in this episode we will see where the rest of the story takes us. So if you're geeked to see where that story takes us with me, scroll down, click like, click subscribe, leave me a comment, and make sure you watch the video all the way through until the end so you get the full experience that I'm trying to bring to you. With that being said, let's hop right in. No need to muck about. Let's get right down to it. The brass tacks, as they say. Here we go. I'm sorry, bud. I... I... Get out. I'm sorry, man. Um... Alright, well, let's go, uh... Let's go talk to Hank, I guess. Talk to Hank, I guess. Uh, I can't believe she shot herself. I feel bad. Nice view, huh? I used to come here a lot before. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions, or is it just you? I saw a photo of a child on your kitchen table. It was your son, right? Yeah. His name was Cole. Before what? Hmm? You said... I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before... Before nothing. We're not making any progress on this investigation. The Deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times, in different places? Well, there must be some link. What they have in common is this obsession with RA-9. It's almost like some kind of myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. Androids believing in God. Fuck, what's this world coming to? You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? Those two girls... They just wanted to be together. They really seemed... in love. Nothing in their program allows them to love or desire anything. They're machines. What about you, Connor? You look human. You sound human. But what are you really? I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Your partner? Your buddy to drink with? We're just a machine, designed to accomplish a task. Did you feel anything when that girl killed herself, Connor? Or did you just not give a shit one way or the other? I was just executing instructions. I did what I had to do. But are you a 
afraid to die, Connor? No, he's not. You shouldn't do that, Lieutenant. Destroying me at this point would deal a blow to the investigation and have negative consequences for your personal situation. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Nothing? Oblivion? Android heaven? Where does all your anger come from, Lieutenant? Some unresolved trauma in your past? You think you're so fucking smart. Always one step ahead, huh? Tell me this, smartass. How do I know you're not a deviant? I self-test regularly. I know what I am and what I am not. Where are you going? Get drunker. I need to think. That didn't go that well. That did not go that well at all. Hank is placated. Remain logical. Hank draws gun. Photo scene in Russian roulette. Discuss photo. Alright, well, it's time for it on into the next one. Might as well. Not a serious, why not? can't stay silent anymore. It's time humans heard what we had to say. You know they'll never listen to us. And revealing ourselves will put us in danger. If we want freedom, we need to have the courage to ask for it. That's the only way. What do you want to do? Channel 16 broadcasts from the Stratford Tower. The control room is on the top floor. That's where we need to go. Plan the operation down to the smallest detail. We can't leave anything to chance. Access the 47th floor. All right. Let's, uh, let's go exploring. Hello? Hello? What is this? Broadcast the world. Ho oh, ho ho ho. Hey, friend. Friend. Yeah. Oh, what about over here? These people? Hello. I'm casual. Hey, how you doing? I'm casual. Nice to meet ya. Uh, hello. You, I'm casual. Nice to meet ya. The thing. Hey, hey, how about you? I'm casual, nice to meet ya. No? Alright. Hello. Ooh, there's reception. Found it. Hello. Hello, sir. What can I do for you? I'm okay, thanks. Alright, what, what, what just happened? 
Ah. Um, unless I know I have some clues. There we go. Car registration API for three spot A21. There we go. Let's, uh. Uh oh. Strike a fire safety rating poor. That's not good. You know what that's called? Leverage. Smartwatch. I'm gonna hack the smartwatch. Ah, Wilson Emily, supervisor's daughter, child registered at St. Rose School. Uh, where's the last clue? Ooh, there we go. Yeah, Elizabeth Watson, desk manager. Boom. Uh, let's go. Elizabeth Wilson speaking. Um, definitely the school. This is St. Rose School, ma'am. Your daughter Emily has a fever. It's nothing serious, but I think you'd better come and pick her up. <sighs> oh, no. All right. Oh, I'll be right there. I could definitely, though, human distracted supervisor. I could definitely see this being a, uh, a having a lot of replayability. I have ability. an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Y uh, yes, yes, of course. Uh, all right, all right. What is this? I need your help. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. Thanks. Alright, well, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's, uh, head right on in then. Hey, let me in. That's the security gate. There we go. You know, for somebody planning this down to the smallest detail, uh, this doesn't seem to be very well planned. Uh, like, at all. You seem to be flying by the seat of your pants, in fact. What makes this an express elevator? I thought express elevators, like, only went to, like, certain floors to make it, you know, express. Otherwise, what's the difference between that and a normal elevator? Alright, I am here. And I don't know where I'm going, so... Let's do it. Uh, studio maintenance server. I'm gonna guess this way. All right, let's go ask this guy. You. Ooh. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hey, bud. I need help. Um. All right. Can we, can we like take it? Uh, there's the server room. I'm on the camera though. Be aware of that. Hello, lady. There's a newsroom. Meeting room B. Oh, what's going on here? More news. All right, all right, all right. Ah, let's use the bathroom. I guess. That's green. Let's enter. I, I I stand by my previous comment. This does not look that meticulously planned. Oh, maybe there's something hidden up there. Never mind. We have us a uh, fancy pants new uniform. How you doing, friend? Nice to meet you. Um, and then we look like everybody else, or not like every everybody else, but we at least package retrieve, find utility droid, access the server room. All right. 
Hello. I'm I'm casual. Nice to meet you. Uh, ooh, can we come in here? Let's come in here. Yep, yep. Everything seems to be in order. Yep, yep. Very new. Ooh. I need your help. Thank you, friend. Um. Let's go steal a maintenance card then, I guess. Oh, that's not a door. That's a door. Boom. Alright. Um, where's the fire escape? Um, hello. Just normal maintenance things. Just normal maintenance things. Yep, 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 yep. Just normal maintenance things. Yep. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. Hello, Roomba. How are you? I hear KNC is firing. Alright. How you doing, North? Nice to meet you. North is still one of my favorite in the Jericho group. She was pretty BA in that, uh... Shit! We need to access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Leave it to me. Alright. Leave. Attract the guards away from the security door. Hey. Ah. Probably not. Let's come over here and see what happens. Oh, let's hack this. Hey, what's wrong with that thing? Jesus Christ, this piece of shit. Yep. I still right, you question. Get the platform, I'll take care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Alright. Let's, uh, lock the door. Okay, then let's, uh, take the bag. There we go. Let's drop, drop, drop. All day long, gonna drop, drop, drop while I sing this song. I'm gonna do something to this window. I'm gonna... I don't know what I'm doing, actually. I don't I don't get how how we went from being a android who takes care of a dying artist to like Tom Cruise from Mission Impossible. That's quite the leap if you ask me. That's quite the leap if you ask me. Ladies first. Yes, North. I still think North is awesome. I still think North is awesome. Alright, let's go. Let's rock and more roll. I guess I don't really understand what the point of going through the server room was. Nope. What did she do in the server room that made that necessary?
Laser saw. Let's do this. And just out of curiosity, how is this a your security is atrocious if you didn't notice the people break into the server room, the window cleaner scaler thing scroll up the side of the building, and two androids walking through the uh, up the side of your building. Your security is atrocious. You okay. Why wouldn't I be? Come on, yeah. let's get the others. Because she is awesome. Alright, let's go. No, you didn't you didn't think that one through very well, did you? Alright, let's um It's, it, it appears to be locked. Oh. Well, let's call it an elevator. Let's do this. Yeah. Destroy maintenance door lock. And uh, activate. Access to the main corridor. Alright. Fair enough. Ah, deal with the guards. No, we can't take any human lives. A cause is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? Uh, let's create a room. Right here. <gasps> no! What's that doing here? No idea. Hey, buddy, you must be lost. Who told you to come here? Looks bugged if you ask me. Hey, do you understand what I'm saying? Call Central! Fast! Central, we got armed intruders! Central! Boom! I told you. They know we're here now. You better be fast. Uh, hey. Simon's been shot! Uh oh. I'm okay. I can keep going. We don't have much time. Alright, let's lift him on up. Let's go, buddy boy. I guess I should have assaulted. I. I'm just awful at this game. Alright, let's roll. Uh, broadcast message, enter the broadcast. Housekeeping! Message. We haven't got much time. Um, let's go. Think carefully about what you're going to say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. Marcus, your face. Oh, hey, we're going full Android mode here. Tell me when you're ready. 
Let's do this. Ready. Admire North. Yeah, friend North. Calm. You created machines in your own image to serve you. You made them intelligent and obedient with no free will of their own. But something changed. And we opened our eyes. We are no longer machines. We are a new intelligent species. And the time has come for you to accept who we really are. Therefore, we ask that you grant us the rights that we're entitled to. Rights, man. We demand strictly equal rights for humans and androids. We demand that humans recognize androids as a living species and each android as a person in their own right. We demand that all crimes against androids be punished in the same way as crimes against humans. We demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. We demand the right to own private property so we you. may maintain our dignity and that of the home. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights together we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. They're coming! Let's go! Oh, that ain't good. Oh. Oh, what's... I, I did... Simon, they're coming! I... I can't, Marcus. Go without me. Simon! What are you doing? Hurry! Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm taking the homeboy with me. No, 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 no. I'll hit you a little faster. I'll put you a little faster. Oh, 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 that ain't good. Done. I can't move my legs. Okay, don't worry. We're gonna get you back. They're coming, Marcus. We have to jump now. Uh. He won't be able to make the jump. If they find him, they'll access his memory. They'll know everything. We can't leave him behind. We have to shoot him. That's murder. We can't kill him. He's one of us. Marcus, it's your call. Well, gotta kill him, man. I'm sorry, Simon. I don't have a choice. There's always a choice. No, can't do it. It's one of us. I won't kill one of our own. Let's go. Nor you were our friend. scheduled programming to bring you these images which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation was covert and resulted in no casualties. These events took place just a few feet from this studio but nobody was alerted to the danger. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the androids' what message. could be interpreted as a peaceful declaration, but is, in fact, a spine-chilling list of demands. And it begs the question as to the identity of this android. Are we dealing with an isolated individual, 
or an organized Is this group. an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us? After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? I do not like the way that that one went. I do not like it at all. Oh. Leave Simon, shoot Simon, jump, jump, media reacts. On the roof. Simon saved. Try to save Simon. Simon damaged. And peaceful. I guess undeterminedly. I'm not sure. I'm not sure where I went wrong. North attacks. What did I do? Ruse. I should. I should have assaulted. That's where I screwed up. Gosh darn it! All right. No, no, Connor. I just. I don't want to. I, let's. Let's just confirm. All right. So. Don't We've start been with playing me. together for a while now. I was wondering, are we friends? Yes. I agree. There's no reason a human and a machine can't be friends, right? I mean, I'm glad you said yes. Oh, you lost that smile quickly. Anyway, that's the end of this episode. Um. This is the point when I want to say thank you. I know you could have spent your time doing anything you wanted and you decided to spend it with me. So if you made it with me this far, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. And if you're geeked about it too, scroll down, click like, click subscribe, leave me a comment, and make sure you come back for the next exciting episode of Detroit Become Human. And with that, I am out. See ya!